name is Ava, and I'm going to be telling you about the flags and rip currents. Green flag means the waves are very calm and easy. The green flag means there's no rough waves. What's a green flag mean, Wyatt? That it's calm, there's no current, tiny waves. Tiny waves? Yellow flag means medium hazard, there's a chance that there could be really big waves. Yellow flag means be cautious, but you can still go in the water. The waves can be high at points, but it's not going to be high like red flag. Like so, red flag means that there is a strong current. Also, knee deep is too deep. Red flag means knee deep is too deep. When you get in the water, you could get sucked up in a very big rip current. Double red flag means if the water is close to public and if you get in the water, you'll get a $500 fine. Really bad rip currents, waves are giant. Double red flag flag is closed to the public. No one can get in the water. If you do, you will get a $500 fine. There's a huge rip current with um, double red flag and also there, the waves are pretty big. We have purple flag. Purple flag means there can be jellyfish or stingrays. Purple flag will never be alone. It will be with any flag, but it can't be purple and purple. Purple means that there could be jellyfish or stingrays. Purple flag means um, dangerous marine life and it's always flying with another color. And then we have rip currents. Rip currents will be where there are two breaks and you'll see waves crashing in on one side and then there will be um, a more calm spot in the middle, which that means that's where the rip current is. So you never want to go into the more calm spot. You always want to go to, to the left or the right. If you get in a rip current, swim towards a lifeguard or swim to the side. A rip current is when there is a break in the sandbar. And to notice if there is a rip current, the water will look more still and it will look deeper and darker. If you see a sandbar, see waves, and then there's a place that looks very calm and it looks darker than areas that it's not opposed to. And if you get stuck in one, you want to swim parallel. Currents are when big or strong enough waves that uh, come and break the sandbar. Uh, so a way that you can tell that uh, there's a rip current is if in the sandbar, um, a dark spot part of the water will be <laughs> will be smooth, doesn't have waves. If you get caught in a rip current, uh, you would swim left or right or just um, follow, follow the sand.